there. Um, sorry for interrupting you. Uh, is Maria here? I beg your pardon. Hello, everyone. Have you ever talked to a person and then it appears that you cannot make out what the person is saying? Right. In this video, we are going to look at the main accents in the English language. And also, I'd love to teach you how to recognize them and even imitate. Fine, maybe not to imitate, but to understand what makes the difference between them, some special features and tricks. It's fun, isn't it? Well, the first one is... Right, just watch the short scene and try to recognize where this accent comes from. Mama has sent me down to welcome you and to ask you to dine with us tonight. Unless you're too tired. That was quite posh. So here we go. Receive pronunciation or posh British English or Queen's British English. This is a well-known English accent spoken by the royal family and other members of the upper classes in the UK. It is an accent that fascinates many non-native speakers and students as it sounds quite posh, elegant and luxurious, but however, quite old-fashioned. If you want to speak with a posh accent or let's call it modern RP, here are some tricks for you. Proper pronunciation and good articulation are highly important. I was born to rule the Seven Kingdoms. And I will. No glottal T. Try not to use glottal T wherever possible. For instance, cotton, cotton. Forgotten, forgotten. Better, better. Water, water. One more important thing that you may notice is that there's no R sound in some words in RP. The R sound is basically missed before a consonant. Here are the examples. Dark, dark. Born, born. Afford, afford. And I can afford really good childcare. Now you know how to speak posha. Oh, it's seat time. So, um, darling, can you leave that biscuit for me? Forgive me, I've got to be going. Subscribe for more videos and stay tuned.